Hey YouTubers, Viking Pipe 5 for 5 here, uh, giving you the inaugural smoke of my latest pipe that I featured in my last video, the Sears Jacopo uh, Domino Series uh, 1999 that my girlfriend gave me for Christmas. And uh, today I'm smoking uh, the Ashton Artisan Blend. It's a very good uh, English blend. I think it ranks up there with uh, the Nightcap. I actually prefer this over the Nightcap. Um, I know Pipe Lawyer really likes this. And uh, I suggest you go out and give it a try. Um, now on to the main point of the video. This is for uh, Dunhill Man UK's video of the top three tobaccos of 2011. And uh, I want him to... Uh, I want to thank him for this video. I think this is a great thing that we can do. Um, I mean, maybe even uh, every six months we can do this. And uh, my top three for 2011 starts off with 1820 by J.F. Germain and Son. And this is a Latakia Oriental and Virginia blend. And it is a, a, a ribbon cut. Um, when I first bought this, uh, I was expecting like a flake or something, and I opened it up and it was a ribbon, which is fine. And uh, the name gets gets uh, 1820 from when the company was actually founded. And uh, the reason I picked that tin up for the first time was uh, from Mock Mock Mark, I believe his name was. Um... I really miss his videos. I think uh, last thing I heard from him was uh, he got a girlfriend and uh, his YouTube days kind of ended. <laughs> so that was that. And uh, my second one, I know uh, the Dagners don't really prefer this blend. But uh, when I first picked this up and I, I went through a 10 in about a week and I normally don't ever do that. And uh, I just think this is a fantastic pure Virginia. It's Flake Virginia by John Alsbury. They're a fairly new brand, I believe. They just kind of popped up on uh, smokingpipes.com. And uh, I want to check them out. These tins are, you know, pretty darn cheap. I think they're like 9 bucks on sale. And then if you buy more, you know, you get discounts and whatnot. And uh, I know the Dagner said that it smokes pretty hot. And if you're not careful, you know, any Virginia is going to smoke hot. But, um, you know, if you're just careful with it, you can find, uh, you know, a lot of sweetness that comes out of this. And, you know, I'm sure I'm going to get a lot of grief from you guys and uh, a lot of haters. But um, I actually compare this to Full Virginia Flake by Sam Lee Gowith. But um, I kind of have some reasons. I don't know if it's because of the availability of this. Um, that when you smoke it, you don't feel like you're smoking, you know, gold. So you kind of tend to maybe, I don't know, look at that factor of it. Whereas, you know, when you get a tin of full Virginia Flake, you know, you're almost afraid to open it. Because you don't know when, <laughs> you don't know when you're ever going to get it again when it's going to start showing up so for all you virginia lovers such as myself go out and check this out um it's a it's a beautiful it's like uh i don't know how to explain it it's like a big ribbon of tobacco it's like a huge flake and it's like kind of bundled up in itself on here i've never seen a, a tobacco like that before this is a sealed tin i put it so i can really open it right now and my third one is, most of you all know, is 1792 Flake by Sam Legowith. Um, this is a dark-fired Kentucky and Virginia. And I believe this uh, name also gets its name from when the company was founded. Um, this Flake is just so unique and different. Um, the flavoring... You'll, you won't get this kind of flavor from any other tobacco out there. And the nicotine punch is pretty substantial. And um, the flavoring actually comes from a Tonquin flavor. Tonquin? 
T-O-N-Q-U-I-N flavor. Um, I guess they add that to after uh, the tobacco has been pressed. Um, I don't really know anything about it, so if any of you know about it, you know, feel free to inform me. But um, that about does it. Those are my three tobaccos of 2011. And also, if there is a fourth, I might have to throw in Artisan Blend just, just because. <laughs> Alright, so that's my video for tonight. So, cheers to you all. Have a good one.